Okay, I wanted to show you my very favorite softy making tool, hemostats, also called surgical forceps. Hemostats are a little bit like scissors, but the blade is dull. And there are some ridges inside of here, which allow you to grasp fabric. And here at the end, there's a clamp, which allows you to clamp onto fabric and hold it very tightly. And these are commonly used in hospitals in suture kits and you can also order them from doll making and teddy, ma teddy bear making supply companies. These are my favorite tools for softies. Here's a little bird body and I've sewn the two layers together and I'm getting ready to turn it inside out. So I'm going to open up my forceps, put them in through the opening and I'm going to grasp the head. You can see there I have grasped it between the blades of my forceps and then it's super easy to just turn this little body right side out. This is especially good for very tiny pieces or hard to reach extremities. And you can also use your forceps to poke all the little bits right side out so you have a really good turn. And here's my bird turned right side out in just a second. Another good use for forceps is stuffing. So here's some fiber fell stuffing. I can just grasp a little tiny bit in the blade of my forceps and insert it right into the bird's body. Push it all the way to the end and this is great for packing the stuffing in there really really firmly and then just go ahead and get a little bit more and keep stuffing. So forceps are a super tool. They are not expensive and if you get them from suture kits from a hospital they are free um, they come in a lot of different sizes. That's my sort of big all-purpose pair. This is a smaller pair. You can see it's a little bit shorter than this longer pair. Um, it has smaller blades. I don't love this pair because the inside is flat instead of being ridged. So when I go to grasp the fabric, it tends to slip. So I don't use this pair very often. But I have a similar pair. It's similar in size to that pair. but. It's got some big differences. Number one, the blade, as you can see, is curved here. And number two, it's got the ridges that my all-purpose pair has. This is my favorite pair of forceps. The ridges really help grasp the fabric, and I can reach way up inside in a, even a curved spot or a spot that's really hard to reach uh, for turning and for stuffing. So this is my, my favorite pair of forceps. I also get, just recently got this new pair that's called an alligator forcep and it's really long and curved. There's a big curve here and it opens right on the ends. I'm still experimenting with those. But if you don't have a pair of forceps yet and you like to make softies, I would recommend that you go ahead and get one.